41 after the hour here on NRANews.com and Sirius Patriot 144. Hey, that's too bad I left my flower pot hat at home. That would have worked out perfectly for this segment. Every time I think about bringing it, I just, you know. All right. Uh, t- <laughs> Coming up top of the hour, we'll get to uh, more of your talkbacks. We've got some uh, other news stories to get to as well. David Adams, president of the Virginia Shooting Sports Association, is with us on the program right now, however. And, David, good Friday evening to you, sir. Good Friday evening to you, and Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Uh, We're getting off to a quick start in Virginia, because next week the Virginia Crime Commission is meeting. Yes, one day before the General Assembly opens for the 2009 session. And uh, they could be making some uh, anti-gun recommendations? They could. I think it's pretty safe based on what Senator Ken Stolle, who I think is co-chair of the uh, commission, uh, said after they met in December. Uh, he was asked about uh, the gun show loophole being recommended out of the commission, and he said he really didn't think that was going to happen. In order to have legislation recommended from the commission, you have to have a majority of both parties because it is a bipartisan commission. And a majority of both parties have to agree uh, to recommend uh, legislation coming out of the commission for the session. He said he was pretty adamant. He didn't think that a gun show loophole bill would come out of the commission. But there was talk of legislation to possibly identify what or who constitutes a dealer in Virginia. And that's a, what, a little bit of what I'm worried about possibly coming out. Who constitutes a, a dealer? Like, <laughs> yeah, like somebody for, beyond a, a federally licensed firearms well, dealer? Right. Uh, for purposes of private sales, uh, setting some arbitrary number uh, of guns being sold, I guess, in a year. Um, so that's, you know, that, that's, I just think that's opening up a Pandora's box if that's the route they go. And I don't have any indication that that is what will come out. That's just what was being talked about uh, after the commission meeting met in December. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, so, I, I mean, is there anything that gun owners can do before the crime commission meets? Yes, they can contact the commission members. Uh, they can go to uh, our blog. We've got each member's contact links on our blog, uh, or they can just use the commission email address, uh, and that was sent out by the NRA earlier this week. Uh, I personally think it's more effective to contact each individual member of the commission individually and urge them uh, not to support any legislation having to do with the gun shows or uh, setting some, you know, creating a new dealer uh, definition for Virginia. That's not unnecessary. We already have that at the federal level, and it's called a federally licensed individual. Yeah, yeah. Now, what about the uh, the, the quote unquote gun show loophole? Uh, I mean, we, we, we know that this is a priority, and it again, it's another attempt at ending the private transfers of firearms. Uh, is there is is there any thought that they would uh, attempt to go just that route? I don't think the commission will. I, I'm sure we will see legislation uh, because we have every year for the last five or six years dealt with a bill uh, during the general assembly having to do with the gun show, what they call the gun show loophole. Uh, I really don't think, based on what Senator Stolle said, that the commission is going to come out and endorse uh, or recommend legislation uh, specifically toward uh, the loophole, though. Okay. All right, and uh, again, Tuesday, January the 13th is when the Virginia Crime Commission meets. Will we know their recommendations that day? Oh, yes. Uh, I mean, I'm sure it will be covered heavily by the press. The press was there heavily in December, and um, you you may even find uh, it on one of the press websites shortly after the meeting uh, ends. You will know that day, yes. All right. Well, David, keep us up to date, will you please? I sure will. All right. David Adams, uh, president of the Virginia Shooting Sports Association, joining us here on uh, Cam & Company.